Oh, Ty Key Smith. Smith from Fantastic. the University of Georgia, a player that we have talked about a ton, a fantastic defensive back for the Georgia Bulldogs. Yes. A lot of familiarity between Tyke Smith and the Tampa Bay Buccaneers. Of course, the son of Todd Bowles, the head coach of the Bucs, Troy Bowles, plays for Georgia and was teammates with Tyke Smith. This is a fantastic pick that adds to the secondary of the Tampa Bay Buccaneers. The Bucs get a defensive back, a safety love, that can do love, love this, this safety pick. can do it all. We're not exactly comparing him to Antoine Winfield Jr., but he's a physical guy. He has great football instinct. And for a safety, for any defensive back in general, when you have a high football IQ and you can anticipate plays and you can reroute receivers and make a play on the ball before the receiver is even looking at it, that is a huge check in the box for a column of positivity. This is a guy that can play up the line of scrimmage. He can make tackles. He can take the ball away. This is a slam dunk home run. Pick six, 99 yards for the good guys. Fantastic job by the Bucs with this pick. Yeah, th this this was a guy that, that we've had targeted for the Buccaneers for a long time. He is a Buccaneer safety. He is a Todd Bowl safety. A couple years ago, Matt, Todd Bowles liked Lewis Seen from Georgia. This guy, I think, is even better, and Seen went in the, the latter part of the first round. This this is uh, this this is exciting, man. I, yes. We've had him in our mock drafts. He is a Bucks best bet. Tyke Smith, th this is a guy that, that can tackle. He can blitz. Yeah. He can create interceptions. He had four picks last year for Georgia. We saw him at the Senior Bowl. I liked him better than Javon Bullard, and Bullard went ahead mm -hmm. of him. I liked him better than Kwame Lasseter, and Lasseter went ahead of him. But this guy just has the intangibles, the toughness, two years at West Virginia. Yep. And then this guy fills out the stat sheet, like you said, similar, not as athletic, not as fast, bigger than Anton Winfield, but kind of the same guy mm -hmm. in terms of, of just when he's on the play, he's going to find the football and make plays. This is an absolutely outstanding pick. For the Buccaneers, it gives the Buccaneers some absolute backup yes. uh, at the safety position because if this team right now, they just got rid of Richard LeCount the other day, another yeah. Georgia Bulldog. If this team has to play without Jordan Whitehead or without Antoine Winfield Jr., all of a sudden the safety just position crumbles. Right. Uh, he can also play nickel corner too. He can also be the slot guy. So it's not like he's going to be a backup. You're going to see this guy contend for playing time, whether it's at safety, whether it's at nickel corner in the slot. He is a chess piece, and he is a dynamic player. This this right. pick he, excites he me. Is a and if you're watching ESPN yeah. right now, or is this NFL Network? This is NFL mm -hmm. Network. But, yes, they have the camera on the Buccaneers yeah. room as they all just clap it up making this pick. Yeah. And I, I'm glad you Home said run. he is a player. He is a chess piece. Yes. He is a guy. You cannot just pigeonhole him and put him in one spot they got a great great football player with tyke smith i got to talk to him yeah. a little bit at the nfl combine he's a dude that means business he absolutely means business and just thinks just think what this can do for opening up things if they want to play smith on the field with anton winfield jr oh, and, no, no doubt about and, it and jordan whitehead as well because todd Bowles can draw up and line up a lot of different things this allows antoine winfield jr to roam free if you want, yeah. or you could have Winfield play back and, it'll, and it allows Tyke Smith to roam mm -hmm. free as well. We know how great Antoine Winfield Jr. is as a blitzing safety, but he can't do it every single time. Now, you can do it way more often than they already do, and they send him a bunch. You just helped out an all-pro safety yeah. in Antoine Winfield Jr. by adding this chess piece. And you might be thinking, oh, well, they already have two safeties. That's not what it's about. That's right. Partially, it's about depth, but it's about just adding something different to this Buccaneers defense. And we know, we know Todd Bowles loves to draw up different things. We see it a lot on the interior level, on the defensive line, yep. but he can do it in the secondary as well. Let's remember, Todd That's Bowles. That's a great point. Todd Bowles was in charge of coaching up these young pups back in 2020 when, you know, Carlton Davis was much younger and Jamel Dean was much younger yep. and Antoine Winfield Jr. was a rookie. So, he knows how to implement 
players of all experience, whether it's a rookie right. or a veteran. He did it with Christian Izian last year, who was an undrafted free agent. With all due respect to Christian Izian, there's a lot more talent with Tyke Smith, who obviously played for a national championship winning team a couple yep. of seasons ago and still perennial powerhouse.